This is So I like You Know, the podcast your mother warned you about. Are you crazy? These kids could really hurt themselves with this stuff. Oh, God, I thought that was absolutely dreadful. Bam! How's it going? This is Bo. This is JP. And I'm Chow. Hi, and this is So Like You Know, the podcast your mother warned you about. Yeah, we already said the normal stuff. Welcome. So, hi! Um, if you guys can't tell, we got a new webcam and it looks fucking awesome. Makes yep. a big difference. If I sit up too far, you can see I'm fat now. Wider angles. <laughs> you can see my messes. <laughs> And JP has them too. Yay. You can't see shells because she's not here with us anymore. I know. She's she's here with us electronically. <laughs> yes. <laughs> like in yeah. spirit, but slightly physically. <laughs> it's kind of weird. The caress was awkward. You know, this is shell. <laughs> Hello, shell. You feel so plasticky. <laughs> so, anyways, also she doesn't look so whitewashed anymore. No, the camera is much improved. Yes, I agree. Um, so the craft brew, uh, yeah, that's not what we're drinking for the show. That's what we're drinking right now. Um, but anyways, so uh, yeah, if you like us, don't forget we do a live show every Thursday at 9.30 Mountain Standard Time right here on Spreaker.com slash S-L-Y-K Radio, as well as Facebook.com slash S-L-Y-K Radio where we have our live feed. And you can chat with us in both areas. Um, if you want to follow us, our shenanigans throughout the week, obviously the Facebook page, and we're also on Twitter at S O Y K Radio, um, and then we're also on Stitcher and iTunes at the same thing. As you can see on the bottom of the screen, right there, follow us. I figured out how to do scrolling letters. How cool is that? Oh, nice. Yeah, right. <laughs> Just like I'm fancy. We're gonna, we're, it, iTunes, Stitcher. See, and then Facebook, we're, we're, Twitter. We got to make this. Wait. Yeah, this, we got rid of untapped. This. Ah. I didn't realize I did. That was an accident. Interesting. I don't know why it's gone, though. That's weird. Um, I can fix that. I can fix that. I can do Retro- things. Retroactively? Yeah, hold on. Watch. So we add this, and we do image. And, and it's broken. We hit OK. No, yeah. no, I ain't going to break it. I ain't going to break it. But anyways, yeah, you can follow us on all kinds of different platforms. That was weird. This loaded into platforms. Uh, but yeah, we're all over the place because we uh, love attention, and that's how that works. We are attention whores. Da, this is good, yeah. Right there, untapped. Got it. So cool. Yahtzee. <laughs> Yahtzee. So, anyways, guys. So, uh, yeah, this is the show for. Wow, it's just it, the year is flying by. I know, I can't believe it. Oh, yeah. It. April 13th. I mean, we're getting, like... It's going to be... It's a, Summer's going to be over before we freaking know it. It's going to happen. Um, but you know what? That's how it goes. It's only three, three and three and a... Three and three and a quarter more years. No. That was an incredibly strange sound I just heard, and I don't really know what it meant. It sounded like, you know, those, wa- those rainmakers... Ice. In a swirling in a cup? No, I like what JP said, Rainmaker. A Rainmaker? Oh, well, it was me swirling ice in the cup. Because <laughs> I was trying to get Tommy to get me some more water. Ice in the cup, ice, ice in the cup. <laughs> so, but yeah. Um, also, hey, Lewis! Um, but yeah, so make sure you come chat with us on the Facebook page, because we love people. Or um, the speaker. Or in the speaker, yeah. Uh, where's Daniel? Minus a Daniel. Dude, I, okay, I'm gonna message Daniel. You should uh, tell him about the beer while I'm messaging Daniel. Oh yeah, thank you. You should tell him about the beer that you can't see. So right now, for our craft brew in review, <laughs> we're drinking Los Locos Lager <laughs> from Epic Brewing Company with a 4.8 ABV. Los Locos is a sessionable, refreshing lager with a hint of corn sweetness and a dash of sea salt with a perfect kick of natural lime juices. Not only pairs perfectly with spicy Mexican dishes, but a great accompaniment for all your favorite summer activities. Spicy. Super spicy. 
And as soon as we pour this out, you can see it in our Facebook feed, in our craft room review. Oh yeah, let's get this thing out of here. That was a placeholder. <laughs> now all they can see is Legos now. Uh, who else? We got Daniel. Because we need Daniel. Daniel fact checks us. <laughs> that Daniel will just will be blabbing we, we about it. We have crap. to Google. You, we'd have to tell some lies, and you just have to believe it as alternative truth. <laughs> Here you go, sir. Well, that was the weirdest way I've ever spelled Devin. And there you go. Duvon. Right there. God, it looks so much clearer with a better camera. Yeah. Both <laughs> cameras were upgraded. Yeah. <coughs> I wonder how, how good the audio is on that. Uh, everything I saw, saw online said, that's awesome audio, but this is still better. Oh, okay. It doesn't it's, com- it's dedicated. It doesn't compare it to the beautiful blue Yeti mic, yes. Robot dildo. Robot dildo. <laughs> Robocock! So, uh, Shell, do you want to tell everybody about one of our sponsors? Yeah, yeah. Um, so, are you guys looking to protect your $600 investment, being your smartphone? Then you should probably pick up your hangings today. It's a little handy device that attaches to any phone that has a phone case without any f- modifications, allowing you to strap it to your neck, round your wrist, your purse, your backpack, to keep it from falling to the ground. It's only four ninety nine with free shipping, so you can go online to our website, so like you know dot com and click the link and get your hangings today. Um that's hangins, H A N G I N Z. Yeah. Hang- Hangins. Woo! I was like very like short and like choppy. Sorry guys. <laughs> <laughs> That's alright. Yeah, I know. You're, you're trying to type at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but but anyways. Yeah, yeah. What is this? Refresh, bitch. There we go. So lonely here. <laughs> but anyways. So yeah. Coming up next is Slick Feed. Where we geek on your week. I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's Sorry, not me. I, was, I thought JP had that one. That's, that, that's not what we decided. Gosh, Shell. <laughs> Stop being I efficient. Did, it just did hang in, so I thought JP had that one. Oh, okay. okay, fair enough. <laughs> it's forgiven. Why, is, why isn't she live and in person? Uh, it's because uh, our wonderful Shell is at her home up like you know 80 miles away from us <laughs> <laughs> literally uh, it's, I don't know I think it's more than 80 miles like 100 miles away 100 miles to, to the spring from here forevers forevers yeah, away yeah, that's what that is I'm on the other side of the state cool <laughs> even on the other side Colorado's bigger than that <laughs> well like yeah but whatevs Whatever. So, uh. 92 miles. <laughs> that's a long damn trip. Yes. Mm. About 100 miles. Hey, Daniel! And awesome! I, I think that's that's a good reason to be late to the show. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, uh, getting a Guardian 2, or Guardians of the Galaxy 2 tickets. Oh, nice. nice. Yeah. I am so excited for that damn movie to come out. And it's happening way sooner than. Mm hmm. People think. Hi, Velasca! What's up? So, yeah, um, but, so, sciencey stuff. Uh, to avoid crashing into uh, one of Saturn's moons, NASA is going to be destroying the Cassini probe, uh, which was launched back in September of 2000, or sorry, 97, um, but is a $3.26 billion vehicle that they're going to blow the hell up uh, coming this summer because it's running out of fuel. And it's kind of on a collision course for uh, one of Saturn's moons that might actually harbor alien life. But, oh. I like, what do they have in there that's, like, do they pack, like, a small like, like center of, of, like, um, TNT in there? Or? <laughs> well, they're going to use whatever, the fuel reserves that are left in it and ignite that to blow it up. Wow, it seemed very unsafe thing to <laughs> put in there. It's like, just in case... <laughs> don't let them take you alive, probe. <laughs> <laughs> Self destruct. You don't get to know where this came from. Dude, I wonder how long that signal would take. Like if they once they hit that button, how long is it instant? I don't know. Or is but it, it through like radio waves it, they have to It sounds like a lot of 
Oh, it worked on Skype. No, our gear effects are low. Yeah. No, I'll remember guess. that for next time. By <laughs> the way, it did power. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, but it, it's cool that they're doing that, though. I mean, they don't want to contaminate any kind of life at this point that might exist, be it maybe even single cell life. It's still mm-hmm. something we got to explore before we totally freaking kill it. Mm-hmm. So, right. Um, kill switch engaged. Kill switch. Uh, so speaking of killing things, though, um, if you guys don't have a hangins, I'm sure you've probably dropped your cell phone. Um, and if you dropped it, you've probably cracked your screen. No. Not on oh, his. Yeah. Well, you got a nice fancy thick case. <laughs> You're a smart person. <laughs> Other people who try to uh, They take their cases off for some weird reason And then they don't have a case on their phone For like a month Taylor Shell um, Hey, no, whatever <laughs> I've had a new. I've had a case on this phone for like Always uh, now, like Your new fancy phone, yeah The first week I had it Um, Yeah, that, that, but that's not your Android Your Android, you just left that thing Free oh, roaming that thing, that thing was like I don't know. I will say, Android <coughs> Notes, they're pretty, they're pretty sturdy. <laughs> With the note case. Just make sure you get Gorilla Glass. You kind of have to. to that effect. Yeah. This new stuff looks cool. So, what did the chemists in the uh, University of California find? So, the uh, chemists in the University of California, Riverside, uh, recently invented a smartphone screen material. That self heals. How fucking awesome is that? So the uh, the material is uh, it, it bonds on a, a microscopic level to itself. So something that they did as a test, they tore it in half and put it next to each other, and it sealed. Back to where it was. Yeah, back to where it was. So that's pretty cool. Like, I mean, I know there's like all sorts of materials out there, like. Um, I have a self-healing uh, cutting mat for quilting. Yeah, and I mean, it, it self-heals to a point. Yeah, I was going to say, there's mm-hmm. always a point to it. Yeah, but this one is more like an indefinite self-healing. That's pretty cool. <laughs> also, I'm sorry for the coughing. I am getting over a cold, and it sucks. Um, but yeah, so uh, it's pretty amazing looking, actually. Uh, I was... it. It was over a 24-hour period that it heals. But still, I mean, the product itself can actually stretch up to 50 times its own size, which means the odds that you drop your phone is probably going to... It's not going to really crack to start with. Mm -hmm. But even if you take your phone and bend it in half, like they have some sort of magical phone that you can do that, and it's fine. I can. Uh, Japan has it. Not true. That's because Japan has everything that's better. Um, we're, we're ten years behind. Well, no, I, I'm realistically, it's like two or three years behind in cell phone technology. Yeah. No, it's, I mean we're behind on a lot of stuff. I was just listening to NPR on the way home, and uh, talking about the uh, like the sky traffic that we're still using freaking radar, whereas the rest of the world is on GPS. Yep. Ridiculous. We're still using regular old Ethernet cables when everyone else is out fiber optics. Yep. Um, we are. Uh, Sponsor is good. Please, that would be amazing. <laughs> I will plug everything Google if they did that. Yeah, we're, we're going to we put our hangings in our Google Pixel phones. <laughs> right, I would dump iPhones so fast. <laughs> be like, I will throw this against the wall right now. I don't give a shit. I will lose all the photos if Google sponsors us. <laughs> They're all backed up anyways. But, um, no, so I mean, it, it's pretty amazing. Uh, not to mention the material itself is uh, um, electrically conductive, so that means it works as a touch screen, which is you know part of the reason why these work is because you can touch the screen and it senses how it works. So that's why it's good for the uh, cell phone industry. So I mean, altogether, it's just a badass product that I'm sure will have much wider implementation than just cell phones. But considering that's such the, a widely used product in this day and age, that's pretty amazing. So, um, stuff that is amazing. That-